Yo yo people, Gertune here for another video. So guys, this video is going to be in Farming Simulator 19 and today, wait, no, wait, let me, let me grab something. Alright, this is what I'm talking about guys, there we go. Um, but yeah, let me, let me explain what this is. First off, let me, uh -huh, there we go. Um, pretty much, I have a challenge for you guys, right? If this video breaks 325 likes, I will wear this mask in a full video. It's gonna be crazy. I can barely see out this thing. Uh, there's just these two mesh eyes. But yeah, 325 likes and we'll wear it for an entire video. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so now that that's out of the way, let me explain what we're actually doing here today. So we are on one of our very old save games. This is the one where we did all of the different freight shipping and all the warehouse videos, right? So we delivered for UPS, Amazon, Walmart, a bunch of other companies, and I decided to revisit it just because I know that series was definitely one of this channel's biggest series ever. It was also definitely one of my favorite series that we've ever done. So bringing it back only made sense. I don't know if we're gonna fully bring this back or just do this one video, we'll have to see. But anyways, what we're doing to start off is moving some pallets over to Walmart. Now, UPS actually got hired to do this job. Obviously, Walmart has their shipping companies, but uh, yeah, just the way they are obtaining this merchandise or this product, I should say. It's not really merchandise necessarily. There we go. Let's back on up. Perfect. And this is just the default forklift. I will be linking in the description as many mods as I can. But here we go. Let's lower it down a bit. And what about this view? Is this going to help us at all? Let's see. All right. There we go. We're not completely centered. Got to go a little bit lower. I think that should be good. All right. We don't have the best grip on it. Here, if we kind of back up and slam forward, it might shift it a bit. <laughs> But we'll go ahead, move it over to the trailer. We're actually bringing it to the trailer that I was backing up in at the beginning, which is right over here. Yeah, look at this, guys. This is the warehouse made by Exley. Very, very well made. Uh, and lots of the other mods, guys, like this trailer and truck, they're made by Exley and Iconic Upgrades, which is very cool. I'm going to go ahead. Let me just quickly see if we can get this positioned on a little bit better. Just like, oh, come on. Just like so. There we are. And yeah, we'll bring it into this trailer. So watch our sides. Ooh, I forgot to put on our hazard lights. Let's go ahead and get that moving. There we are. And we'll lower down a little bit more just so we don't collide with the roof there. Perfect. Okay, bring this right to the end, or at least pretty close to the end. Thinking that's probably pretty or go a bit further there we go lower it down back on up and we can now grab the next pallet so yeah we should probably watch behind us if we're speeding out that fast there we go gotta learn this warehouse uh, if you guys remember we did so many videos on this we knew this in the notes uh same with this forklift we were so good at driving it but yeah we are a little bit rusty not gonna lie but yeah only only practice will make us perfect. Back this up. There we go. And watch those edges there. Remember we always used to hit on the sides of the shelves and then it made the cargo just fly on off. We'll go forward. Uh, also guys, another thing. This is the first video I'm recording with the channel at 30,000 subscribers. We have done a live stream, so that's why I didn't mention it right away. But... Yeah, I just want to quickly say thank you so much. I really do appreciate everything you guys have done for me uh, over the past years. And if you guys didn't or didn't know this, we started the channel back in 2011. Uh, but me and my friend Justin started actually making videos back in 2009 for it. So I've grown up making videos. That's really just what I've been doing my whole life. It's really all I know to do. And if you guys also did or didn't know, I'm even going to school learning to become a filmmaker because uh, that is my passion for my long-term career. Yeah, so having this YouTube channel growing and growing now at the 30k mark, it just shows me that what I'm doing, what I've been putting all this work into, you guys are enjoying it. And that's really 
what I made this channel for. It's for people, well, one is for me to have something to do and enjoy doing it with my friend. Uh, but the other thing was for you guys to watch and I never expected it to get the size it is now. I definitely never expected this. If you were to tell me back in, I don't know, grade three or four that I was gonna be sitting at 30,000 subscribers on this channel, I would, I would not believe you, but we are in fact here and I know that sounds so cliche, I've never seen 30,000 people in person at the same time. Like that, I can't, can't even imagine how many people that actually is. Like that's filling up stadiums, which is insane to say. Um, but yeah, so guys, just thank you. I really do mean it. Uh, I hope you guys also enjoyed the giveaway that we did during the live stream. Gave away Planet Coaster, which is a $60 game on Steam. And yeah, it seems like it went to a very good person. I seem to be enjoying the game from the messages they sent. Anyways, let's go ahead and lower it down. Perfect. Back on up. And we have one more pallet to grab. Is it on the top or bottom shelf? Uh, it is on the top shelf. All right. <laughs> it's going to be a little bit challenging, but we've already done one of them. We can do another. All right. Here we go. And before I actually pick up this pallet, here's a message from our sponsor. Join Lambamod's Patreon page to instantly receive access to some amazing modding creations. You will get early access to Lambo, Winston, and Beardshot's awesome ideas. On top of all that, you will get cool textures and other unique modding tools. Join today using the link below. Alright guys, I got it on the forks. Let's go ahead back on up. Awesome. And let's lower it down a bit. Pretty cool. Okay, turn this thing. Do not want to hit that shelf. I'm really scared by doing that. <laughs> go right over here to the second trailer. Again, this is the last one we'll be picking up and then we'll be able to hit the road, which I'm looking forward to doing. We have not driven on this map uh, in quite some time. It's been, I believe, a few months. So yeah, awesome to revisit it once again. And I will be linking down below. I believe this is called uh, California Central Valley, if I remember correctly. But again, it's been a while. I could be wrong about that. Anyways, we're going to leave this forklift right here. Uh, this might glitch a little bit, but I'm going to try bringing the back in first. Here we go. All right. Looks good. We haven't messed up yet. Awesome. We actually did that all correctly. Now we should be good to drive on forward and then close up the doors before we get moving too fast. There we are. Yeah, let's go ahead. I uh, will take a left out of here already. Uh, actually, should we turn our headlights? I don't see why not. All right, I got the headlights on. You can't really tell. I honestly had to double check because I wasn't sure, but there is a little display that indicates down there. If I go over this, you can see that they are on. can actually make them a bit brighter. There we go. Got the full ones running now. Very cool. So yeah, we'll go past this turn and I believe it will be the next left. If it's not the next one, then it's the one after. Uh, okay, so I believe this is where you get off the ramp. So yeah, we'll go one more over. Here we go. Now this truck, guys, if you've never seen me use it, uh, it does roll quite a bit. It comes with the trailers, in case you didn't know. All right, let's make this turn just like so. Nice and wide. Very cool. Let's see our trailer. It's following along nicely. And yeah, now we are finally on the highway, so we can gain a little bit more speed. Now, I don't want to go too fast, just because we do have cargo in here, and it's mainly strapped down, but the forklifts are actually not. So we got to watch out for that thing. We'll try staying in the lane the best we can. Here we go. Traffic seems to be pretty much non-existent right now. I do have it enabled, though, so we will hopefully start seeing some vehicles but let's go ahead run cruise control we'll go 45 miles an hour i think that's a pretty solid speed it's a little bit faster than the cars go yeah there is one of them right there very cool and we have another in front of us that we're quickly catching up to also uh if you guys have been watching for a very long time you will remember we got a man pulled over there i forget what his name was uh, oh, what was it? I want to say it was like Pablo or something like that. I don't know. 
But yeah, there there he is. Very, very cool. He, he's been pulled over for quite a while. I don't know why the traffic stop is taking so long. But let's keep on moving. Uh, do we make this clearance? Oh, yeah. No issues there. Just wanted to make sure since maybe they lowered the little bridge. Okay, it's not really a little bridge. Well, no, okay. It's not a huge bridge, but it's also not really, what you say, small <laughs> by any means. Let's keep our eyes on the road. We're actually going to be turning. Uh, we need to go to the left lane. There we go. And yeah, we'll be taking not really side roads necessarily, but just not the not the whole interstate the full way. Let's slow it down. There we go. All right. Now, this is a very tricky intersection. Cars on this map do not wait for us. Uh, okay, that one seems pretty far, so we should be good to go. Look in our mirrors. And I believe we have that, like, taco truck or whatever coming up. Yeah, I think if you look on our left, we should see it momentarily. Or it's some kind of some kind of food truck, I believe. Where is it? Oh, there it is. It was hidden by that big dump truck. There we go. And we got our music playing, too. Awesome. All right. Move along through here. There we go. Bakersfield finally entering it and I actually see the Walmart sign in the distance as well okay so I'm gonna say let's stay in this lane for now until that one widens a bit more and then we can move on over probably should move over now since our turn is approaching quickly awesome okay really slow down now gotta turn here All right watch for cars there we go Took it a little bit wider than we had to, but our trailer should see follow behind here momentarily. Maybe not. Okay, why can't I see it in? Okay, well at least we know it's attached. Yeah, just wanted to double check that. Here we go. How are we making this turn? Uh, ooh, that car actually did stop. Interesting. I thought they didn't stop on this map. Maybe it's just the highway then. I'm not too sure. There we are. Look at the suspension moving on all those individual tires. Very, very nice. Now, people just kind of walk randomly throughout this parking lot. I'm going to try my best not to hit anyone. But if it happens, well, it happens, right? <laughs> there we go. The same does not go for real life, though. That is only in video games, guys. <laughs> Do not hit people in your life. It hurts. I've, I've experienced it, as you guys know, or many of you do. There we are. Now, we're just supposed to leave this outside, so we don't really need to back up into the bays or anything. And let's lower the ramps. Open the doors. And get those things laid down. Perfect. Remove the straps. I always forget to do that, but not this time. I, I, I re finally remembered. <laughs> Can go in our forklift. And turn this bad boy on. We'll turn on the light right away, or the beacon, and our headlights actually, why not? Here we go. Let's pick up this first pallet. Should be nice and easy. Awesome. Okay, uh, we need to straighten out a little bit in this trailer. There we are. Just so we go off the ramps. Kind of centered. Oh, I did not raise them enough. No! Oh, rookie moves, guys. Rookie moves. Okay, let's see if we can get on this again it's a little bit hard when it's on the ramps just the way the collision works in the game but we do kind of have it on the forks and we'll just put this oh this is sketchy it's really not on here we'll just put them right over here nicely done all right got some weird collisions though but no biggie yeah i don't know what all these weird bumps are let's grab the next one Go up these ramps. Okay, so raise this up. But then before we get to the top... Ooh, come on. Before we get to the top, we need to lower it down, or else it will hit that roof. We've made that mistake so many times. Can't Cannot count them on my fingers. <laughs> Slide right like so. Perfect. Back her up. Go down the ramps. Raise it up, raise it. There we go. Nicely done. All right, we also have our weird bouncing issue in the game. It happened before the video started. I restarted the game, but it seems like it's doing it again. Shouldn't be too bad, though. I'll show you guys once we get this off what I'm talking about. In case you 
aren't familiar with this series. We experienced this issue many, many times. Let's go ahead, drop this down. Okay, actually, let me see if I can show you guys what I'm talking about. All right, let's floor it backwards. This should work. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And we hit some weird collision box. Anyways, let's go ahead and actually do this properly now. Oh, come on, stop bouncing. You got this. There's no traction on the wheels when that glitch happens. Okay, let's pick up this pallet, just like so. We'll back it up now. Ooh, we're actually very close to that wall. Let me try centering a bit better. There we go. We lower down a little more just to watch the roof height once we hit the ramp. It does raise ever so slightly. Or actually quite a bit. More than I realized. Okay, okay. So stop with your bounciness. And let's grab our final one. Come on. Off the forks. <laughs> Let me just kind of shimmy this forward. There we are. Perfect. Yeah, we'll grab the final one and put it on the right side. All right, let's drive up here. Yeah, you can really see the bouncing in this view. <laughs> there we go. Lower that down. Perfect. And final one right at the end. Here we go. Can we get first try? Ooh. And yes, we did. All righty. Head on out. Keep forgetting we can just turn our head. It's not really realistic though to turn your head that much. Uh, just obviously you can, you can turn your head like this, but fully backwards, that would, yeah, that, that would not be possible. <laughs> Lower it down a bit and that should be all good. All right, awesome. Now, last thing we have to do is drive this on the trailer we can head back to the warehouse. All right, I got it on there. Let's turn off our lights. Perfect. Turn off the engine now. We can head in our truck. We'll fold up the ramps. I say fold, but we're just kind of sliding them. But we will fold the doors. And there we go. Make this turn. Made it nice and easy for us when we first arrived. Ooh, did I not put down the straps? Yeah, let me... Yeah, it doesn't actually strap, but just for some kind of realism. Even though I don't believe it would slide around in real life. Not quite sure, though. Never experienced this myself. But yeah, guys, that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, 325 likes means that I'm going to put that crazy mask on for an entire video. I don't know how that's going to go, uh, but also would mean that the face cam's on, which is pretty cool. But yeah, besides for that, guys, uh, down below, you can find our Discord server. You can find our merchandise, Patreon, Twitter, Instagram, lots of different things. Yeah, go ahead, click all those links, and as well, our website, plus the mods used in this video. You guys are awesome. Have a great day. Oh, one other thing. Channel members are getting some more videos, so check that link as well. You can also bypass slow mode in stream chats and have your name highlighted if you become a channel member. But yeah, you guys are awesome. Bye bye. Want to play games with your friends? Grab a dedicated server from G Portal. Make sure to click the link down below to receive an instant 5% discount.